DaVinci Resolve 14 is the biggest update in its entire history and is designed to revolutionize and completely change the way post-production is done. DaVinci Resolve 14 adds major performance improvements, advanced Fairlight audio post-production, incredible new multi-user collaboration tools, and hundreds of new features for editors and colorists. When it comes to performance, DaVinci Resolve 14 features a new, completely modern high-speed playback engine and optimizations that make it up to 10 times faster than before. Scrubbing is more fluid, and JKL playback is instantaneous. Now, when you tap a key, the clip is precisely trimmed to exactly the frame you want. This is especially noticeable when working with multicam clips. It's so fast, you can even work with processor-intensive formats, like H.264 on a laptop. In addition to performance, editors can now import clips directly into bins on the edit page. Multiple bins can be viewed at the same time, and bins can even be opened into their own windows. Once you've arranged everything the way you like it, simply save your own custom screen layout. The Source Viewer features a new overlay that lets you quickly drag the audio only, the video only, or both to the timeline. New marker overlays in the Source and Timeline viewers make it easier to see details and notes on a clip. In List View, the Disclosure Triangle lets you see clip markers. You can even drag a marked portion of a clip into your timeline. It's like subclips, but with markers. DaVinci Resolve 14 introduces a new Undo History list, so you can now step back through your actions. The Effects library on the Edit page now includes Resolve FX. To add an effect, Simply drag it onto a clip in the timeline, then change its parameters in the inspector. Tracks can now be assigned colors, so you can quickly identify things like dialogue, sound effects, and music. When you drag clips to the timeline, they automatically take on the correct track color. There's also a new audio mixer, along with a parametric equalizer on the edit page. But for total control over your audio, DaVinci Resolve 14 has an entirely new Fairlight audio page. Fairlight Audio was previously only available in high-end facilities. Unlike audio tools that were designed for music, Fairlight Audio is specifically designed for film and television post-production and is known worldwide for its incredible sound quality and speed. When switching to the Fairlight page, you'll see the playhead in the exact same position as it was on the edit page. The audio timeline is optimized for multi-channel recording, editing, mixing, and sweetening, so you don't have to round trip or export to another application. The timeline can display subframes or even samples, and the ruler under the playhead changes accordingly, so you can make precise edits. If you want to zoom in on a clip, you can adjust all track heights with the slider. There's also a menu for selecting zoom presets and turning on different view options. Right-clicking on a track header lets you lock individual track heights. You can also add new tracks, change their type, and even add a color. When you need to edit waveforms, you can zoom in all the way down to the individual sample level. Click the Mixer button to open the Fairlight Mixer, which has a channel strip for each track. When you select a channel strip in the mixer, the corresponding track is highlighted in the timeline. When used with the Fairlight Audio Accelerator, you get up to 1,000 tracks with real-time parametric EQ, dynamics, and effects. Without it, you'll get around 60. If you're working with a lot of tracks, you can use the small mixer view to fit more channel strips on screen. You can also open the index and choose which tracks you want to see. Every track includes real-time EQ. Simply double-click the EQ area on the channel strip to open the six-band parametric equalizer. This lets you precisely adjust the quality and character of sound on every single track. Each track also has independent dynamics processing with an expander, gate, compressor, and limiter. The track panner can be used to position sounds in 2D or 3D space, depending on your track format. Any sound on any channel can be mapped into 3D audio space. The effects library displays a list of VST audio plugins. Simply drag a filter to an individual clip in the timeline or to an entire track on the channel strip in the mixer. Using the marquee tool, you can select a portion of the clip and loop playback while making adjustments, so you can instantly hear the results. The Fairlight Audio page features extensive automation controls for recording parameter changes over time. 
You can automate everything from simple level changes in the mixer to panning and even third-party plugins. DaVinci Resolve supports up to 450 outputs that can be routed to 16 different sets of multi-channel speaker systems for monitoring. To quickly adjust the volume of your monitors, use the volume slider. Clicking the speaker icon will mute output. The dim button can be used to temporarily drop the level if you need to speak with someone in the studio. The track headers on the left show individual meters. You can click the meter button to see a more comprehensive view that shows everything in your project, including separate meters for all sources, tracks, buses, main, and sub outputs. The powerful Fairlight busing architecture makes it easy to create a new bus. In this example, we'll use the bus format window to add a 7.1 sub bus, type a name, and give it a color. Clicking Bus Assign lets you select tracks for output to the new bus. We'll select all tracks and save. The new bus appears in the mixer and in the meters, where you can monitor the signal passing through it. DaVinci Resolve automatically folds up or folds down the output as needed between any 2D and 3D formats. You also get complete multi-channel recording that goes far beyond the simple voiceover features found in most editing software. For even more speed and power, DaVinci Resolve 14 works with dedicated Fairlight audio consoles, which feature tactile faders and controls, along with an edit control that lets you quickly and efficiently work on complex projects. With Fairlight Audio in DaVinci Resolve 14, you don't have to send audio out, translate it to another system, or wait for it to come back. You can keep editing, grading, and mixing right up to your deadline. Plus, you can master multiple versions in multiple delivery formats and languages at the same time. There simply is no other editing software with this level of dedicated audio power. When it comes to color correction, colorists will be thrilled to see that DaVinci Resolve 14 also includes over 20 new CPU and GPU accelerated Resolve FX, along with a new stabilizer, match move, and dozens of other creative features. The amazing new face refinement filter automatically recognizes and tracks facial features so you can quickly smooth out uneven skin tones, brighten eyes, and even add natural color into cheeks and lips. Best of all, you don't have to manually select or rotoscope a single frame. You can use the new warper to reframe or align objects by pushing and pulling parts of the image. Additional points can protect areas from distortion, so you get the shot you want without unwanted artifacts. Additionally, dehaze makes it incredibly easy to remove atmospheric haze, glare from windows, or fog from a lens. With over 40 different effects to choose from, such as blurs, glows, lens flare, face refinement, sharpening, camera shake, abstraction, and watercolor, DaVinci Resolve 14 gives you more creative choices and options than ever before. The new collaboration features in DaVinci Resolve 14 let multiple editors, colorists, sound engineers, and their assistants all work in the same project at the same time. When you click on a bin, it's automatically locked. This lets you safely work on clips and timelines in the bin. The icons show you who's working in each bin. Simply hover over the icon to see the user's name. If a bin is locked, Everyone working in the project can still browse and use its clips. You can even view locked timelines or copy them to create a new version. The owner can continue to make changes to any item in the locked bin. When the bin is changed, a refresh icon is displayed. Simply click on it to see the changes. There's also a built-in chat client, so you can communicate with other members of the team in real time. Here we'll ask the assistant to load today's dailies into a new bin. When you receive a new message, the chat icon turns red. When she's done, a new bin will appear, so we can start editing with the clips. Colorists can also work in the same timeline as the editor. When a colorist finishes working on a clip, the editor can refresh the timeline and see the new grade. You can even have multiple colorists working on the same timeline at the same time. An icon for each colorist will appear on the clip thumbnails. If you want somebody else, like an assistant or a sound editor, to work on your timeline, you can duplicate it, continue working, and then merge the changes using the Timeline Comparison tool. The comparison window shows a graphical representation of both timelines, with the differences highlighted. 
You can scrub through to compare the timelines in your viewers, and then accept the changes you want. Best of all, you can use these new collaboration tools with the storage you already have. Smaller studios can set up one of their workstations as the DaVinci Resolve project manager and use local storage on each machine. Larger studios can use a shared storage area network and dedicated workstation as the DaVinci Resolve project manager. With hundreds of new features, incredible performance improvements, professional Fairlight audio, and revolutionary new collaborative tools, DaVinci Resolve 14 changes post-production forever. Download your free copy and try it today.